the male are so much in disbelief that this is them and not being able or being allowed to be in a certain event. They are still in so much, so much disbelief. And they haven't seen it yet. And I bet they are forgetting that Harry is so mature that they are a whole contribution to the loss of his baby. During that time when Duchess Meghan miscarried. They seem to forget that so quick. And they are now out and about crying and, you know, kind of just making it very much obvious. That they are no longer, never going to be allowed to any Harry's event. They need to sit down and start figuring out on what to do next. Because that's one thing Harry and Meghan are going to make it work. And they'll be the last people to ever have information or details about what Harry and Meghan are doing, where it's happening and what not and what forth. Mail. The star success won't give the British media access to their events. Why should they be given permission to? I bet there were the some people who were so much shouting and yapping and saying of how irrelevant they are. They are not loved. They are not needed. And that they should never think of going back to the UK. Now it's them following them around are wanting to have access in each and every single thing they do they're running mad they are running mad because i bet this is just an indication of a whole pure madness it seems that they forget they no longer have control they no longer have any entitlement when it comes to harry and megan never let me check you through an article written by Kazir and let's get to see what Kazir had to say about the same. Last week ended up being a busy one for the Duke and the Duchess of Sussex. Harry and Meghan confirmed two new Netflix projects, a cooking show and a polo show. And they also made some public appearances last Wednesday. Harry at Better Up event about mental health in uh, the sea salts. Better Up uh, pays Harry big bucks to be their chief impact officer. And uh, they use him uh, to sell tickets to their summits and panel discussions. This fact that Harry's exclusivity is a huge bonus to the company who employs him has broken the brain of every British tabloid editor. And to that, to add to that, uh, Harry apparently banned all the British tabloids from uh, the Santabel Polo match in Miami on a Friday. And there was only limited uh, press ac access to a Thursday evening panel discussion on behalf of uh, Santabel. They haven't seen it yet. This is just the beginning. They better get ready to dance to the tune. They thought Harry and Meghan were going to stick and play to their mind games. Harry and Meghan are proving it to them that you know what? We aren't doing this. We aren't doing this. The male seems absolutely shocked and appealed that a private company would control their media and control what I see of a summit, which is only open to people willing to spend four figures on tickets. They also seem shocked that Harry, who is suing many of these British outlets, would make a point of banning the British tabloids from a small panel discussion on behalf of his charity. And uh, he also banned their photographers from the polo match too. All of which led me to the male's piece. You can go check it out if you wish to. But I won't be checking you through it. There's still so much in denial, in uh, disbelief. That you know what? This is happening. They never thought Harry will get to this point. But Harry is definitely showing them what he is capable of. And of course, they can't stop him. They've done more than enough. 
Harry and Meghan have tolerated them for such a long time. That's beyond imagination. That's too much. They haven't seen it yet. That's one thing I'll repeat over and over again. Harry and Meghan just got started. By the time they're done, they'll all be down. While I think uh, it's partly about control, and I will uh, get to that in a moment, it's mind-blowing uh, that this guy is going out of his way to bash the success for having credible security concerns and uh, trying to control who is around them and who is monitoring them. It's not about being asked a dumb question from some tabloid uh, hack who crushed a panel discussion it's about the very real, credible, and violent threats of the Sussexes. As for control, yeah, the Sussexes get to control who covers their event. You know who else is a control freak. Could it be William and Kat who have been manipulating photos and videos to lie and misrepresent themselves? Will and Kat have always closed down their events to the media too. And they have uh, often, they have often uh, released their news and photos days and weeks after the fact. Are they doing that because everyone hates them or because they are control freaks? They always uh, don't see that. They always don't address that. But when it comes to Harry and Meghan, they feel that they're so much entitled to address whether it's going to happen or not. That's where they, they're making fall out of themselves. Because Harry and Meghan are never going to give them a chance. They're never going to get a chance. Not today, not tomorrow, not the day after tomorrow. They have the whole right to choose who to and who not to. So for them, they just have to accept that, you know what, that's the reality. That's it. And there's nothing that can be done to bring a change from it, basically. That's from my own perspective, because I'm like, basically them, what's pissing them off is the fact that they won't have first-hand information. Not when it comes to photography, not when it, when it comes to coverage. They'll have to do like what they did at Follow March, and that is, you know, capture the events and pictures from a distance. Like they are out. That's how they'll only be able. But them having an entitlement to cover it while inside in the event, that's definitely not the Duke of Sussex allowing it to happen. The Duke of Sussex just got started they haven't seen the other side of him yet that's by my own perspective i don't know what's your tech on this kindly just let me know on the comment section hoping to see you guys in our next videos